Well, now that was quite the fall. You had me worried. Come, it's time for a reunion. He wouldn't give you up, despite my efforts to persuade him. Sam! Jesus. Hey, you made it. Dude. It's all right. He is like a girl. Is that right? How about we get these cuffs off and I'll show you how girls hit? What the hell is she doing here? You said find out, I got help. Yeah. I must admit, you are quite the schemer. First you steal my disc, then you have your expert run me around in circles, huh? <laughs> That's clever. Perhaps there's a little Indian blood in you after all. Let's finish what we started. All right, all right. <laughs> so, nay, boss. <laughs> Don't talk to me. <laughs> I was gonna say, you look good. Was I not clear? What's that smell? Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't exactly had access to running water and soap recently. God. All the people you could have brought with you. <laughs> she saved my ass more than once, you know. You do remember that uh, she also tried to kill Nathan and I many, many times. And to be fair, you two tried to do the same to her. Uh, yeah, but it, that's not the point. The point is that the second we turn our backs, there will be a knife in there. I can hear every word you're saying. I know! I trust her. <laughs> you know what? Fine. I guess I'm just a little bit irked that we are walking away with nothing. But I guess you know what that's like, right? <laughs> oh, my. Real classy, thank you. Time and place, children. More that came from. Bike racks after school. Ugh. Just hurry up. the kings have one final test. Looks like you won't be needing us, though, so we'll just be on oh, our on day. the contrary. Surely you know the story. <laughs> you see, Shiva gave Parashuram the mighty axe that struck Ganesh in the face, bringing Shiva's son, one of the greatest of the gods, to his knees. Another casualty of war. Don't. Yeah, seriously, Chloe, he's just gonna kill! Uh, he's right. But if you refuse, <coughs> you will watch them die, inch by inch. All right! <coughs> Chloe, don't! Guys, welcome back. Got another puzzle here, I guess.
Shiva and Parashurama. What now? Don't try anything stupid. Not seeing anything but this. Chloe, don't you give this schmuck what he wants. Quiet. My patience. He's so smart. Why is he figured it out? Alright, I may have to edit this out. Wait a minute. He's yielding. Thanks. It's going to fall. Quiet! Ganesh. Quite an obstacle you've placed in my path. So, uh, what? Put the arm down? Unexpected. Holy shit, she's got balls, huh? I, I don't understand. It's an idiot. That's because you've got it all twisted, my friend. Ganesh allowed himself to be struck by the axe. That makes no sense. Not to a selfish prick, no. You <laughs> see, Ganesh could have defeated Parashurama easily. But if he had, that would have made Shiva's axe look weak. Powerless. Ganesh sacrificed himself to preserve his father's honor. See, even she gets it, not a drop of Indian blood in her. Magnificent, isn't it? Oh, what? Nothing to say now? Oh, if you like, I can tell you where to stick it. <laughs> well, my friends, I would love to kill you myself, but we must not anger the gods, for you have brought me a great fortune. Okay, then, what are you doing? I'm going to flood the chamber. I will miss you. Come on, is this really necessary? You know, nothing is ever truly destroyed. Only purified and reborn. Just shoot us and get it over with. Right? As the water fills your lungs, you will have time to reflect on the choices that brought you here. Perhaps in your next lives, you will fare better. Prick. I don't know about you guys, but I got a lot of regrets swimming around in my head right now. Tell me about it. I was really looking forward to kicking your ass again. Hey, you know, I'm not exactly thrilled about drowning next to you, either. Could you give it a rest, guys? I'm trying to concentrate. What are you doing? A little preparation goes a long way. Ha-ha, <laughs> yes! Yeah, I figured we had to do this. Oh, no, got it. Hold on. Ah. Okay, now do me. Coming! Oh, damn. damn it! 
Ah! Ladies first! Bowie's here, not to rush you, but could you please hurry the hell up? Take a deep breath! <laughs> I gotta quit smoking. <laughs> Professional courtesy. <laughs> of course. So, are we good? No. I figured. If we hurry, we can intercept them before they make the sale. Huh. And there's our ride. These are nice. There. Railroad tracks. Stop here. I saw we'll have lookouts throughout the area. Best door on the side of caution. Right, right, right. And then we lose the tusk. You're welcome to stay behind. I'm just you saying. All right, that all right, maybe... right, all right. Less talking, more walking. So all that time in Asov's care, and you couldn't get any intel on the bias? Uh, well, I tried. Asov's a cagey one. Almost never talks shop in front of me. I can't imagine why. Hey, he trusted me enough to believe I was an expert in all this hoisala crap. Hoisala. Yeah, that too. By the way, thanks for keeping him busy for us. Yeah, you know, I wanted to buy you some time in case you were coming to get me. Of course we were. Seriously, thanks. <laughs> I only really thought I was a goner. I wouldn't let that happen. Your brother would never let me hear the end of it. Alright, so, uh... <laughs> Not much of a commentary in this video. Maybe a good thing. Probably a good thing. <laughs> now we got Sam with us. Maybe he can help out fighting some of these guys. Found the train tracks. Sort of. Probably had to go up the other way. Kind of a shock seeing all these modern structures after the Hoysala ruins. Well, it's either British or Portuguese. 1800s, they're not quite modern. See a train over there. go this way? <laughs> Thought for sure we went this way. <laughs> so, uh... I am really liking this game. I know it's a kind of a DLC 
Additional short, really short DLC, but the sort things we're dead. Let's try to keep it that way. So, Nadine, we're not on a first name basis. Okay, fine. I heard you worked for us off too. How'd uh, how'd you deal with the torture? What, what do you mean? Did he torture you? Oh, yeah. Wouldn't stop talking about himself or his cause. It's like, I get it, man. You don't have to sell me on it. <laughs> I'll just say to make some scratch. Can't stand it when people prattle on incessantly. Yeah, I know, right? And yeah, I'm gonna try and find this treasure. Don't know where it is. We'll move on. If we find it, we find it. Well, at least I didn't die. <laughs> This game didn't get the uh, greatest of reviews, but uh, I'm definitely enjoying it. Machete. Uh, little help? No problem. So I'm just gonna hang out. Go ahead. Well, you first. Much obliged. Wow. Cool looking waterfall. <laughs> hey, where's Sam? Don't think he has a rope. Oh, right. Forgot about that. He can sort it out. And another treasure somewhere. <laughs> hey, thanks for not murdering Sam, by the way. You might prove useful later. There you go. Good. Positive attitude. Good act as a decoy. Draw some fire away from us. Throw himself on a grenade and save us all. Guess we can jump until she finished talking. Detour? You coming? Hey, this might do the trick. Holy mother of shit, this is heavy. Oh, damn, you weren't joking. I never joke. Not about anything. You know, one of you could have just let me borrow your rope, but. Oh, 
close. You in one piece? Yeah. Go team! Come on. We're exposed up here. You know, I feel so much safer with her around. I never would have found you without her help, okay? Okay. She just wants to kill me, is it? No, don't give her a reason to. Not sure where we are. This is a continuation of the uh, last episode. So I'm just recording both of them together. So uh, I'll end this video here. Hopefully it's long enough. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.